The last time I tried to cycle in Switzerland, <laughs> this happened. They go for the guy now. Toban. Who got Toban? <laughs> but then I have decided to come back and complete this challenge. So I started practicing. I've cycled in Iceland, did Tuscany Trail twice, and some more cycling. I'm in Switzerland. I'm trying to cross Switzerland. Started from Zurich, finishing to Genoa just having 200 euros. I bought some food before they start off the trip. First 20 kilometers done. Feels good. And, but I'm not liking the weather actually. The headwind is right into my face. And it's a little bit drizzling right now. I've reached the first town of my journey which is Zouk and it is fantastic I'm back on the route and the next stop would be Luzerne Now it's raining, it's raining a lot actually, it's raining a lot. I'm the bus stop right now, I'm cooking my food. And uh, this is what I eat, I don't know what it is. Would be six kilometers more to reach to Luzerne. Finally reaching to Luzerne and it's so packed. And that's the famous Luzerne Bridge. Yeah, <laughs> All good to be here and just walking in this beautiful bridge. It's very famous and this is actually the symbol of Luzerne. That's fantastic. Even the paintings you can see the right behind me. I don't know anything about that but that looks beautiful. Yeah. Goes all the way. I'm back on the highway again and it starts raining again. The weather did not let me yeah. cycle yeah. any further. And right now I'm in the campsite which costs 20 euros. Probably the diff most difficult day of the trip because there would be 20 kilometers climb and there's the hardest part but we can do it. Good morning guys, it's 6 and 30 in the morning, I'm leaving Luzerne and heading towards Grindelwald. People ask me why you do this, why you do this alone. I don't think so I would ever have a specific answer to that. I get more perspective when I do it. You know, sometimes the things that you have are on, you don't value them until they are gone. These kind of trips make me think what is important in life. Taking care about myself mentally and physically, caring about the people around me, and constantly being grateful whatever I have. I will consider this one of my hardest times ever. After the hardest climb of my life, I have reached to the most beautiful town in Switzerland, which is Grindelwald. When I reached Grindelwald, I said like, I'm done. I was not done, but I wanted to just rest i i actually planned to go to interlaken but i said like okay so i find this campsite which is very well located which is a very beautiful place but it's expensive like 26 euros for for place so today 
It was a rough day, tough day, but we did it. And that was beautiful. And we're camping here in Grindelwald. I'm leaving Grindelwald and heading towards to Interlaken. Hopefully to finish it tomorrow. But in order to do that, we have to complete one 30 kilometer a day. Like one 20 kilometer a day, I guess. But no worries. Yeah, and the worst part of it is that yesterday we have spent 65 euros so it means we have less than 100 euros to complete this challenge i've reached to interlaken very quick i thought it would take time but yeah and i'm on the other side of the interlaken so i'm not gonna go to the city center because i have been here for a couple of times so yeah i just saw some beer and eat something This city is like completely different than other cities in Switzerland. Like the structure, like it's huge. That's why it might be the capital. Like I'm here for the last 45 minutes and it's, I don't want to leave it. I'm just walking here and there and look at this bridge and the water. Everything is so perfect. I'm in love with this city. Uh, I've realized that I have completed 100 kilometers today. Woohoo! It's 4 o'clock. It's still like 3 or 4 hours to go. I think I can manage to make 130k. People are amazing, as I told you before. Today I just spent 8 euros for a cappuccino and that's it. And this place is not a campsite. As I always do to ask people if I can uh, camp in the backyards. And today I did the same. And they say yeah you can. And it never fails. Ah, oh. it's good. Geneva it took four days and uh, I spent around 145 euros 145 euros and still we have 55 euros left that's amazing we have completed this motherfucking challenge 